hello guys and welcome to my fitness journey so this is like a video that i've always wanted to be doing from last year because i've been doing gym for i'd say six months consistency consistently now so this is my before this was i say would be two years ago okay this was me at my slimmest and then i put weight on but that's literally as much as my body would um would go um this right picture right there is basically me i think two months into the gym but yeah this is when i started my journey so as you can see i'm deadlifting like 10 kg the bar it's like it's like what how many 10 20 40 kg altogether because the bar is 20 kg but yeah this is the start of my finished journey and then this is where i am now as you can see i've put in more mass more muscle my bum is nice and plumped um again guys this is literally the beginning of my journey however i've wanted to introduce this to my channel for so long um i put this clip in as well because loads of people will say it's the leggings like babe no okay don't <laughs> don't don't do that <laughs> i've got a long way to go okay i know i do however it's 2023 in like a couple of days and i want to introduce this and i want to start introducing this to my channel because this is where i really love i've got a passion for this so as you know like i said i'm starting off and i'm still learning so i'd love for you guys to learn with me for all 2023 and yeah this is literally just i'd say seven months into my fitness journey consistently however i have still yet to get my diet down so this is just a quick routine that i do in my home i've changed one of my rooms into like a gym room i've got i haven't got much stuff yet because gym equipment is bloody expensive however i just wanted to have a few dumbbells the barbell the just kind of like some mats and a bench which is there but we'll get more into that later um right now i'm doing some dynamic stretches and they said it's very very good to kind of warm up your body and loosen up your body before doing like leg days and stuff like that especially when it comes to leg days as well um there's different dynamic stretches for like every part of your body so if it's upper body then it's upper body but if it's lower body then it's lower body okay so i'm not good at voiceovers but i'm going to try my best to explain um as much as of course like i'm saying like i said before i'm still learning however for hip thrust this is how i set up my hip thrusts i'm lining my feet up where my knees were when they were both down and then i push myself up tensing my bum like tense it so much if you're like me who's a visual learner then i've got this program here for you as well that would show you what muscle that i'm targeting um, and i hope that helps so this is your glute maximus that i believe i'm not good with the names yet guys but as you can see it's like the round part of your bum and that will give you the the volume but the hip thrust they target more of the bottom roundness of your bum than the upper if that makes sense but yeah i'm doing three sets of 12 reps of hip thrust with a 10 second hold as well so a little more about hip thrust if you're just beginning like me into the fitness journey this has definitely helped me with the roundness of my bum So this is my second set of dumbbells and I'm not going to change the weight just yet. I do change the weight um, the last set and I just change it just by 10 kg, so 5 kg on each side basically.
But like I was saying before, hip thrusts and glute bridges are definitely a staple piece in your glute routine um, when it comes to lower body exercises when you want to target the glute in particular because this is the best exercise to target the glutes that I have experienced. Like I said before, everyone is different. moving on to bulgarian split squats now this is a hate relationship i don't know if you guys have started anything towards your fitness journey yet but these are definitely a love hate relationship i have started to introduce them into my glute routine and to be honest depending on where my feet are placed i feel it in my quads or i if i bend over like as you see now bending slightly over i can feel it more in the bottom half of my um, glute maximus but yes this targets your glute maximus as well and the sets and reps are all there um these are just dirty like <laughs> these do not feel good but they're definitely contributing into my glute gains Okay, so lastly, I'd go in with some step ups or something with to do with weights. However, I was not feeling myself this time, so I thought I'd go in with some banded um, exercises. And this targets the upper parts of your glutes. I forgot the name, guys. Medius? Is it the Medius? No. There's something I really, I'm so sorry, but I forgot the name. I'm still learning, guys. But I've just showed you an example where it is there, and it targets around there to make the kind of like bubble butt. And these actually hurt. Like, do 20 sets of each leg with this sorry 20 reps sorry not sets guys like are you crazy <laughs> and you would honestly feel it and that the burn is so bad but it's so good at the same time do you know what i mean mm -hmm. 